The James Webb Telescope is busy unveiling the universe's oldest secrets through its infrared vision. But we shouldn't forget that some of the greatest cosmic mysteries are closer to home. The moon, our constant companion, still hides many secrets despite decades of study. We don't even fully understand how it was formed. Recent discoveries have revealed a colossal structure buried beneath the far side of the moon, sparking wild theories and speculations. Could it be a hidden base? Or the remnants of some ancient lunar civilization? Or is there a simpler, natural explanation? If you're fascinated by space exploration and cosmic mysteries, now is the perfect time to join the journey. Subscribe to Space Exploring for more incredible stories like this. And don't forget to like our videos. Together, we can continue unraveling the universe's greatest puzzles. Your support helps fuel our passion for discovery and brings you closer to the wonders of space. Back to the moon. Did you know that humanity couldn't see the far side of the moon for thousands of years? Its tidal lock ensures that only one side faces Earth, a phenomenon caused by the gradual slowing of its rotation by Earth's gravitational pull. This synchronized rotation meant that ancient civilizations could only speculate about what lay on the dark side. Today, advanced technology allows us to explore it, revealing that it's not truly dark but simply unseen from Earth. Interestingly, the far side reflects more sunlight than the near side and has very different features. Unlike the near side, covered with dark, lava-filled plains known as Maria, the far side is dominated by rugged highlands and fewer Maria. These striking differences puzzled scientists until they recently proposed a compelling explanation, shedding light on the moon's mysterious past. But there's more to uncover. Gravity field measurements suggest the far side harbors an enormous structure deep beneath its surface baffling astronomers. Could this be the key to solving some of the moon's greatest mysteries? Stay tuned for the latest discoveries and theories as humanity continues to explore the cosmos. Hawaii's breathtaking landscape, characterized by black sand beaches and towering volcanoes such as Mauna Loa and Mauna Kea, captivates visitors. Imagine, however, a mass five times the size of the Hawaiian islands hidden underground. This remarkable comparison comes from Peter B. James of Baylor University in Texas, who described a stunning discovery made on the far side of the moon. This enormous mass anomaly was found buried deep beneath the lunar surface, and understanding it required delving into one of the moon's most enigmatic regions. The anomaly lies within the South Pole Aitken Basin, the largest preserved impact crater in the solar system. Spanning more than 2,000 kilometers, this colossal scar on the moon was created approximately 4.3 billion years ago by a massive asteroid impact. Despite its immense significance, much about the basin and the consequences of its creation remains a mystery. To investigate further, James's team analyzed data from NASA's GRAIL, Gravity Recovery and Interior Laboratory mission, which launched in 2011, as well as measurements from the Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter. The GRAIL mission involved two spacecraft that measured the moon's gravitational field with exceptional precision, revealing details about its internal structure. When this data was combined with high-resolution lunar surface maps, scientists discovered a massive dense anomaly buried hundreds of kilometers beneath the South Pole Aitken Basin. The anomaly, estimated to be about 2.11 quadrillion tons, is so substantial that it may have caused the basin floor to sink an additional kilometer. To put its size into perspective, this hidden mass equals nearly half the mass of Earth's entire atmosphere. Theories abound regarding the anomaly's origin. Some researchers suggest it may be the metallic core of the asteroid that created the basin billions of years ago. Simulations show that such a core, made of iron and nickel, could have embedded itself in the moon's upper mantle without fully penetrating to its core. Another hypothesis posits that the anomaly consists of dense oxides formed during the cooling and solidification of the moon's original magma ocean. Both explanations align with natural geological processes, though the exact answer remains elusive. Unsurprisingly, the discovery has fueled alternative theories online, including notions of the moon as an artificial space station or the site of a hidden extraterrestrial base. While such ideas capture the imagination, Mainstream researchers focus on evidence pointing to the basin's ancient formation and its role in shaping the moon's evolution. Whether metallic remains or dense oxides, the mystery of the lunar mass anomaly continues to intrigue, offering new insights into the history of Earth's celestial companion. The mysteries surrounding the moon's dual appearance continue to captivate researchers, with two primary hypotheses vying for dominance. 
The answer to whether the moon's contrasting sides are a result of tidal forces or a cataclysmic impact may lie in future lunar exploration missions. Scientists suggest that a massive collision at the moon's south pole could have left behind not only a puzzling mass anomaly, but also influenced the stark differences between the near and far sides of the moon. These differences extend beyond surface appearance. Researchers have discovered that the moon's far side has a significantly thicker crust than its near side, which is enriched with unusually high concentrations of radioactive elements like thorium, potassium, and rare earth metals. This enrichment, part of the so-called creep terrain, remains a subject of debate. Some scientists attribute these disparities to Earth's tidal forces, while others argue they stem from a catastrophic asteroid impact, with heat from the collision altering the moon's interior. One notable hypothesis comes from Matt Jones and his team at Brown University, who explored how an asteroid impact at the South Pole Aitken Basin could have shaped the moon's evolution. Geophysical models suggest that the impact unleashed a wave of extreme heat, creating a thermal anomaly in the lunar mantle. This anomaly likely influenced the moon's development for hundreds of millions of years, redistributing materials such as titanium-rich magma to the opposite side of the moon, where the creep terrain and basaltic plains, known as Maria, now exist. The impact may have also triggered widespread volcanic activity, particularly on the moon's near side. According to simulations, the heat and subsequent mantle convection concentrated radioactive elements and generated enough energy to sustain volcanic activity for hundreds of millions of years. These eruptions began roughly 200 million years after the impact, with the most intense volcanic episodes occurring 300-500 million years later. This sequence of events helps explain the unique geological features of the Moon's near side. In summary, growing evidence supports the idea that the South Pole Aitken impact played a crucial role in shaping the Moon's contrasting hemispheres. By influencing mantle dynamics, redistributing heat-generating elements, and fueling volcanic activity, the event may have been the key to unlocking one of lunar science's greatest mysteries. As we continue to explore and study our celestial neighbor, answers to these puzzles bring us closer to understanding the moon's dynamic history. Subscribe to Space Exploring for more incredible stories like this, and don't forget to like our videos. Together, we can continue unraveling the universe's greatest puzzles. Your support helps fuel our passion for discovery and brings you closer to the wonders of space.